nomadic fanatic gets back to doing what he does best and unstoppable morgan continues her new bronco build hey there blind viewers how you guys doing all right that's right nomadic fanatic he is back to doing what he does best, and that is finding the quirky. That's right, the unusual. Going around traveling and seeing things and taking us along. Yeah, it's been a while. Uh, he's been at the home base or finding things and working on the RVs and dealing with the jacks issue and getting new cats and everything. So he hasn't really been doing a whole lot of traveling and showing us stuff. But, uh, yeah, he finally gets back to doing what he's good at and again it's showing us that quirky stuff because you know he always seems to find that that interesting quirky stuff whether he be doing the lincoln highway route 66 but he usually plans his trips and shows us all that that quirky stuff along the way and uh this time he is in wichita falls well wichita falls that would mean but there are actually falls there, right? Well, there are. But Eric is going to tell us a little bit about the falls. Uh, many, many years ago, a flood came through the Wichita River and took out the famous falls, the Wichita Falls. Uh, after the flooding went down, there was no longer any falls. It was just the Wichita River. But you have this town, this city named Wichita Falls and they said well you know we can't really be called Wichita Falls when we don't have falls anymore so they literally built these falls this is 100% man-made fake falls if you can believe that fake falls hey you can't be Wichita Falls without falls right <laughs> well Eric shows us tells us all about it <coughs> excuse me pretty cool stuff but yeah he takes a little uh walking path up there and he goes up to the top and checks it all out and takes us along as well so along with the falls what else oh we have uh the littlest skyscraper um the big a big shovel some pizza and some local beer so yeah the quirky He's back to uh, doing what he does best on the road. So go over and check out Nomadic Fanatic. And as always, you can uh, go check out the links below to the videos that I am referencing. Because, hey, make it easy for you. I make it easy for you. I just don't say there's links below and then never put them there. I actually put them down there. Cause that's the kind of guy I am. <laughs> and if you don't mind, if you haven't yet, please take a moment to, you know, hook a brother up. It's free. It's free. So click that thumbs up button. If you would mind. All right. What do we got next? We have the unstoppable one. That is right. Morgan. Morgan, what's she doing? It's Vlogimus. She decided that she was going to make a video every day. You know, the Christmas thing. A lot of people do it, but she said she's going to do it. But what is she doing? She bought uh, another Bronco, a different Bronco, I guess you could say. And she is building it out. That's right. She's building it out. Now she says she's not keeping this thing. Nope. Nope. Every time. Sometimes she gets in her head and she has to remind herself, nope, 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 Morgan, you're not keeping this. You're not keeping this. But she wants to make a big pop-up thing for this thing. So she's welding and doing all kinds of stuff. And she has this big cage basically that fits inside the back of the Bronco and it slides out and then it pops up. And then now she's cut a big hole in the top of the Bronco. So she can make that pop up as well. So yeah, Morgan, what is she doing to the Bronco? Oh, wow. Wow. So this 
So the pop-up's going to have to go up a little taller than I first imagined. Oh, dreams. I see a beach right here. <laughs> I see, see a beach. Walk and much, Morgan? <laughs> standing right here. Okay, there's a drop right there, so we definitely don't want this to be the main standing area. <gasps> the bed's going to pull all the way out. We have all this walking area for the kitchen. This is the kitchen. There you go, Morgan. She has big dreams. She has big ideas. Will they work? I don't know. But the point of this whole matter is, is the girl's trying, right? She's giving it a go. She's not just sitting around. She's not just saying, hey, I got this idea or I would like to. She's actually going out and doing it. She's implementing her ideas. And you can't really fault the girl for that. And she's giving it a go. And hey. If it doesn't work quite right, or it isn't quite the way she thought it would be, and it doesn't turn out quite the way she thought or was hoping, at least she gave it a try. But I have confidence. I have confidence. Even though after the last fiasco with uh, welding all that shit on the other Bronco on the back with the air conditioner and this and that and all that other crap and how it kind of all went to shit, I don't know. I For some reason... I have confidence in her this time. I think she's going to pull it off. I really do. I think, I actually think that she might just get this Bronco kind of all done up and weirded out <laughs> and be able to pop it up and stand in it. I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Come on, let me know. Let me know down below in the comments. Do you think this thing's going to work? Do you think she's wasting her time and money? I don't. I happen to think that. I think she's going to get it. I think she's going to pull it off. May not be exactly what she planned, but I think something's going to come of it and she's going to make a decent little thing out of this Bronco. And again, if not, at least she tried. And that's more than I can say for a lot of these folks that are fan dwellers and RVers that just take their ass to court site and plunk down in a chair in the desert and sit there for the rest of the, the winter. So at least the girl is doing something. And as always, you don't have to agree with me. This is blind views. And that's the way I see it. What we do here is go back, 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 back. Loud.